vlog in here in this doctor's office. I'm getting a steroid shot. We need to wait five minutes after this. Expectant mothers. Yeah, that's not interesting. Is there another way to tell me I'm gonna be another grandpa? Gotcha. Yeah. Another grandpa. I mean, you know what I mean. Another grandkid. I yeah. don't even know how to say that. Me neither. I'm gonna be a grandpa again. Again? I'm ready for this. And so am I. <laughs> Just get the hell out of here. You agreed to do all this today. I did I didn't agree to do all this. <laughs> Is it possible to use hey guys i went to the doctors this morning my dad took me i actually went to two doctor's appointment in ob and my doctors my normal family doctor i'm itching i know it's not what i'm supposed to do i got a steroid shot and i will get into my ob appointment later i didn't get to vlog any of it maybe like a few shots that were really nothing because my memory is full. My whole face is swollen as usual. I did get paint for the girls' room. This is the week that they're not here. It's Friday, they go to school and then go to their dad's for the week. So I have the whole week to get the room done. That's my plan. That's what I'm doing. After my doctor's appointments, went by my work to put in my doctor notes for my few days I have off because of what happened and then me and my dad went to Menards and got paint so we're about to start painting hey guys I just wanted to hop on here real fast before I move on with the video and just tell you that I never did in any other videos after this tell you what went on when I got the poison ivy I actually it's kind of TMI but I got it down there and when I went to my OB, it was because I kept scratching, obviously, because I always itch it like I'm not supposed to. I split myself open down there. When I did that, I got kind of scared and I went to the OB. When I went to the OB, my OB nurse told me that I really need to get hold of my family doctor since I kept getting poison ivy over and over and over again. And I did, and that's why I went to my OB and then my family doctor. And when I went to my family doctor, she gave me the steroid shots. And then for two weeks I was on the steroids, which two weeks has went by since that video. That actually helped, it cleared me up. I actually loved the steroids. It gave me a lot of energy, which helped me get the room done. I actually, there's a sneak peek of my room. The OB basically told me that would clear up down there, which it did. And there's been no poison ivy, no problems since then. Then I have this whole new setup, which I will eventually show you guys in one of my videos because it's gonna be on one of my videos. Just wanted to hop in because it's not on this video and let you guys know what went on with an OB. So videos are getting better because of my new setup. So be watching. <laughs>
mirror's coming down tomorrow. We gotta shatter it off. It's like glued on it. So far I've got stopped there and I got all this, this, and this, and then so I got all that to do. Which has the TV dresser and everything on it. So tomorrow I'll let I'll let this dry tomorrow. I'll move everything on this side and finish. Good morning. Well, I don't know if that um, steroid really worked. I think it kind of did, to be honest with you. Besides, I'm still itching all over my arms. Woke up, me and dad's going to Menards. It's bright and early, and the boys are in my room playing Fortnite. I feel like we're like living at Menards, Dad. Gosh, look horrible. Dude, look at this. Me and CJ were coming to this new store. Hail to the knob. Wow. Just I like, wonder because everything's five dollars, maybe. It's a grand opening, yes, of course it is. We could go eat. Lost Holy shit! Some. Oh shit, my money. gosh. There ain't gonna be nothing left in that store. Gosh. Holy shit! Jump right out the window and say that out loud. Holy, holy shit, that's a long line. <laughs> say it again because these people didn't hear me. Yeah. Holy shit, that's a long line. <laughs> <laughs> there is something that looks <laughs> Wow. So we try to go to the Black Friday store and. Yeah, right. Maddie, we're not doing that, are we? That would have sucked with Matthew. Say yeah. no. You hungry? You hungry? Yeah? You'll perk up for that one. Food? You should see online. They're going live on Facebook. It is crazy. But they have TVs, electronics, they have everything. It's pretty awesome though. I wanna see, we should have waited to see what people came out with. Yeah. Got it? That's dead, isn't it? Huh? Yeah. I thought, no, I didn't bring a screwdriver down either. Wow, Dad. No, oh, yeah, I did. Here you go. Matthew, you be an electrician with them? You testing out the wires? Get it. What? You getting up there, Maddie? Are you going to do some work? Tell Papa I'll teach you. Was, well, I was going to start painting, but my dad decided to tear down the room and restart. Yeah, so he didn't do things right. So now we have to go to Menards for like the hundredth time. You like it? Sure. I can't wait till all this clears up. I can't wait to be normal again. I want to go to sleep. Nope. Well, we'll talk to you in a few. Matthew's making a messes. What are you two doing? Oh, Jaden's beating you up, Caleb. Oh. <laughs> Caleb's getting knocked out, dude. You better do something, Caleb. Instead of fighting me like a girl, he bit me. You're being a girl? Ooh.
been in a blah mood. I can't find the carpet that I want. I can't find a few things. And then I'll show you what I've been doing today because I'm done painting the room until I get carpet. I can't really do much more. Laundry area. Reorganize that. Made a mess in here doing it. Oh, let me show you. We've got snow. I love snow because it's white and everything looks so clean. I love it. Love it. Fun day splitting wood today. We had a two hour delay. And then on top of that, my boss comes on the radio and says, keep our phones nearby because the weather's about to get worse and we might have to go pick kids up early. So we already have to go back at one. So now we might have to go back even earlier. What is the point of coming to school today? They should have canceled school, but they didn't. And I have to walk all the way back to the truck because the lights got left on and felt bad for CJ. I've been sitting in a warm bus all day and he's been out here. So I told him I would walk back to the truck, go turn the lights off. So far I'm halfway. to pick up kids early. Oh my gosh, snow is falling off the bus. But there's wrecks everywhere. It's very unsafe out here. I'm gonna guess that. We're gonna see if my prediction's right, you guys. That there's no school. Hang on, someone's calling me. Okay guys, so I've taken a break from this room for one whole day. I still need to clean it to reorganize it. I did this all weekend, me and my dad, fix, fixing the new lighting, the wiring, the painting, going to stores, buying stuff over and over, everything. I had to take a break from it. I figured I can't get the carpet yet. I'm gonna probably do that tomorrow. So i'm going to probably just clean up around here get it ready for when i do get the carpet in here i can still decorate the walls and stuff but for now really can't do much with the floor the way i want to decorate it but you guys have to see outside it was a hot mess driving the school bus today look at it out here full of snow roads are bad I am hoping that we don't have work tomorrow because we did a two hour delay. We had the chance to pick the kids up early. We chose not to do that. It started getting bad when we were picking them up. It was a bad drive getting the kids home. I was an hour over my regular time, normal time. So I guess we'll do a little montage on getting this room clean. <laughs> in the video so i just want to tell you guys good night thank you for watching i hope you have a blessed day and i'll see you guys again next time love ya bye where'd you get those glasses from oh i'm so stupid we got carpet